It's April 26, 2010. I'm Darren Kitchen, and this is Hack Across America video blog for T-minus five days now. And what an exciting day it has been. Uh, yes, it's 2010, not 05, like I said in the previous video, because I was that exhausted. But no, not today. I'm feeling quite chipper, and to be honest, I am rearing to go if it wasn't for the odds and ends that needed to be done. Uh, Paul and I would be uh, on our way right now. But there's so much to be done. And I gotta work. Well, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 With the lights on. No right. Yeah, yeah. You're supposed to be out of here. I'm supposed to have this place to myself, motherfucker. All right, all right. Well, you can have it to yourself as soon as you just help me take all the trash to the dump tomorrow and carry all the stuff on Craigslist. And let's just focus on the positive things, like the accomplishments of the day, and then I won't feel so overwhelmed. Like, I did get that box of, okay, so I didn't make it to Missouri yesterday like I was supposed to, but I did ship out the label printers and a laptop all configured to print labels. I know, exciting, right? Isn't it weird that, like, I get so excited about, like, like process stuff, like, ooh, shipping internationally, customs forms, save money on postage with these little things here and there. I don't know wh what it is. Maybe it's, like, the engineer, the geek, the hacker and such just, like, loves fiddly bits, anything that can, any sort of process that can be uh, tweaked, automated, and, and I don't know, um, words. I don't have them right now. You know what I'm talking about. It's all about like efficiency and that's like exciting on some really, really dorky level. Uh, but what else? Oh, dude, this is awesome. Printed this out. This is my analog backup because I, I really shouldn't trust in solely in technology, especially when I get to the Midwest and who knows about the 3G coverage. But uh, this is an analog printout of the names, phone numbers, addresses, and everything of the over 300 people who have signed up on HackAcrossAmerica.com to you know, put me up for the night, and I am so grateful to each and every one of them, even if I don't visit, and uh, hopefully one of these days we'll be able to do some ridiculous massive party. Um, I particularly love the kill tab, uh, or column there. That's um, on a scale of one to five, how likely you are to chop me up into little pieces and feed me to a dog. And thankfully, out of the 320, there are only 12 that wish to bring harm upon me. So I, I think that's actually pretty good odds. Um, what else is going on? Ooh, editing. Of course, it's Monday, so why wouldn't I be uh, editing? Let's just get a little swivel going on. I haven't, I haven't been moving around much in this uh, this video blog. I'm actually working on my awesomely get a fabulous desk here. Huh? Isn't that nice? Got the cardboard boxes holding up the, uh, the MIMO here. And I uh, figured I'd show you one of the neat things that's going on. Let's see. That is... That is a Jason Applebaum, and he's doing, oh my gosh, so excited, a programming segment. We haven't had enough code segments on the show, and um, and he's, you know, you guys have seen it on the show here and there, but um, but yeah, it's, it's great. Like, anybody that does a solo segment is always going to, on their very first one, uh, have a word. And if you go back to the first season, you'll find that my word was exactly. Uh, I, in many segments, I will say exactly over and over and over. And if, if for some reason, I don't know what it is. Maybe your brain, like when it blanks, when it's, you know, because in a segment, you're constantly trying to think ahead. Not only what am I saying now, but where is this segment going? How am I structuring this? All that stuff. So there's a fallback word, and it's always fun to see somebody knew what word they attached to. I remember particularly Wes said the word nice uh, about 11 times in three minutes on a, uh, a case modding segment. And I'm doing right now, like I've done to everybody in the past who's done this, and then gets over it and becomes a, an excellent presenter, you know, uh, through all the uh, trial and error and all that stuff. Uh, but I'm going ahead and doing some fun stuff in editing. Here we go. We got a, we got a beautiful little. Uh, so. Yeah. You know, Whoop. So we get a little so here, and and the fun thing is, since we're in a computer screen overlay, and let me tell you, on Hack Five, we love computer screen overlays. It's simply a matter of. Snip, snip, and I love this. Just figured this out. Select it, and then shift, delete. Not only does it delete the clip, but it moves everything back. So, like, if I were to, I'll just undid that. If I were to just hit delete, leave this gap here. And not only do I have to select this, but I have to select all that stuff. This is so much easier to uh, just go ahead and make these subtle little edits that make the show a lot more pro. I know, I know. It's the dirty little secrets of uh, of editing, and we don't have that luxury when we're shooting live to tape, which we did for like three years. So to go back to editing now, I kind of like the control. I hate that it takes 
8, 10, 12 hours to edit a single half hour episode, but I absolutely love the ability to tweak all of this stuff, which I can't do on my video blog because it's all live to tape and I'm rambling. So that's enough for, for today and I will see you guys tomorrow. Take care.